Hello students, today we shall study the components of casework. Uh, the helping process of social casework has got four different elements or components, uh, person, problem, place, process or procedure. Without these four components, case worker cannot function effectively. So, first component is person. Like as you are seeing in the picture, person is, person can be a man, woman, a young child or aged or anyone who finds himself or he or is found to be in need of help in some aspect of his social emotional living. The case worker need to understand that client is a human being having problem and enable the person to find some effective way of solving or coping with his problem. Characteristics of the person. The person's behavior is purpose and meaning. When the person come to social agency, the case worker tries to understand the behavior of the client and also search for the meaning for their be behavior and work in relation to this. Whether a person behavior is effective or not in promoting his well-being depends in large part upon the functioning of his personality. Id, ego and superego are the personality structure of an individual. Sometimes person fail to express appropriate personality structure due to various reasons. It is important for the case worker to understand the personality structure of the client. Case worker need to teach the person importance of presenting proper personality structure to lead a healthy, healthy life. Next characteristics of the person, the structure and functioning of the personality are the products of inherited and continuous interaction with the physical, psychological and social environment of the person experience. Here nature means hereditary, nurture means environment. Both plays very important role in the functioning of the human being. What a person equipped with the birth and what experiences from that moment create his individuality. Role of the case worker is to understand and accept the fact that his client brings with him not just his problem and himself to the interview but unseen and vital people and circumstances that have brought him up. Third, uh, next character, our past decides our present life and our present activities affects on our future. Uh, this particular character I will explain with one example. Here past is student was not serious about his reading, present scoring less mark or not lear learning properly, future if he continues similar habit future would not be better. Role of the case worker to understand what client wants for him in the future and also tell him how he moved to achieve these goals. Next character, the person's being and becoming behavior is both shaped and judged by the expectations and major social roles he carries. Every person occupies some position in the society. We are rewarded according to accomplishment of our responsibilities. Man in the role of father, woman in the role of mother, child in the role of a student as an employer. Sometimes social may, roles may present hardship to the person who is a client come, comes to the case worker to the agency for the help. Role of the case worker here is case worker should have an idea about social roles person carries in day to day life. Help the client by explaining the roles, expectations and how he can carry out effectively his roles. Last character of the person is the client comes to the social agency is always under stress. 
whatever the nature of the problem due to uh, failure or pressure in his environment which leads to stress to the client reasons for the client st stress are as follows the problem itself is a threat for the client the failure to cope increase his tension coming to the agency and offering for help uh, is guilt for client here role of the case worker is accept the client understand his stress and work together to decrease the stress of the client students we will go to the next component that is problem so what is problem problem is a situation which is the outcome of circumstances a problem is a situation event or anything which impairs the normal functioning of the individual and makes uh, makes him handicapped now we will study the type of the problems uh, first one is a physical problem that is ill health physical disability and physical hazard etc psychosocial or emotional problem uh, we can say the problems which uh, which is related to interpersonal relationship example mental discord conflict maladjustment economic problem economic problems related to economic system example poverty unemployment unable to get a job or unable to hold a job spiritual or moral problem related to faith crisis belief in god and deterioration of moral values we have done with the types of problems next we will move to the characteristics of the problem the problem first character is the problems are affecting or affected by persons social functioning problems may occur due to certain unmet needs or it may occur due to stress uh, problems affects the well being of the person he or she cannot perform his or role social functioning better role of the case worker to understand the difficulties of the person is facing by interacting with him and significant others helps the client to readjust himself to the situation helps him to cope with frustration and tension finally help help him to become a happy and healthy person next characteristics of the problem a case worker and client need to work with the problem step by step by simplifying it and treating it stage by stage it is difficult for the case worker to treat the problem entirely hence the attention is given those problem which need immediate help example head of the family lost his job there are like lot of problems associated in this particular problem but uh, here the first concern is client not his problem case worker help the client to select on one of several problems based on his professional knowledge and judgment third characteristic of the problem is problems of human beings have a chain reaction single single problem that re, that creates other another problem as we discussed in the uh, previous slide one problem leads to any many other problems example business loss students uh, till now we have studied various characteristics of the problem um, like to conclude uh, today we have discussed the various components of the case work first one is person in person we have studied meaning of the person and characteristics of the person and in problem we have again studied the meaning of the problem various types of the problem and characteristics of the problem we will continue the next uh, rest of the other characteristics by next class thank you so much